Artemis 1 launch teams are back at Kennedy Space Center, not for an actual launch, but for a test of the Mega Moon rocket's fuel system. Engineers installed a new, uh, new seals on a leaky fuel line that forced a scrub of a launch attempt earlier this month. Wednesday morning at around 6 a.m. Central Time, teams will begin filling the rocket's tanks with super cold liquid oxygen and liquid hydrogen. And they will add fuel more slowly this time to reduce the likelihood of leaks. If the test goes well, an actual launch could happen a week from today, Tuesday, September 27th at 10.37 a.m. Way 31 is providing you with complete coverage of Artemis 1. We will travel back to Kennedy Space Center next week for the launch of this test flight. We've also prepared an extensive special report on the mission, the next giant leap. We talked with those in North Alabama who designed and built the rocket and run the program right here at Marshall Space Flight Center, along with astronauts who will return to the moon on future Artemis missions.